What's up guys, this is iTweaks here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to take a screenshot of web pages on your iPhone or iPad with Awesome Screenshot Safari extension. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is download Awesome Screenshot in the App Store. So you can see it's just like this and then once you download it, this is a free app, you go ahead and tap open. So you want to open this up at least once and then you can go ahead and open up Safari. So if we open up Safari here, you'll see if we tap on the share panel and we go over here and we're going to tap more so we're going to add another action extension and then you'll notice that we have a toggle for screenshot. So we're going to toggle that on and then we're going to tap done and then you can see that we have that screenshot button right there so if we tap the screenshot button right here you'll notice that it loads up the entire screen and then you can either take a screenshot of what's visible or the entire page so you just decide which one you want to do I'm gonna go ahead and do the full page so if we tap on that you can see a little loading dial and then we have the entire page right here so I can scroll through the entire thing so this is gonna be pretty useful for those of you that need to take screenshot of pages for whatever reason possibly it's a very long article that you want to read when you may not have internet so you can take a screenshot of the entire thing and then be able to read that later on now you'll notice you have a bunch of tools down here you can crop you can add text you can draw lines all kinds of good stuff so if you want to mess with that you can do so with that as well but once you're done go ahead and tap the check mark and then you have that so you can either copy it you can share it or you can just save it so if we wanted to save it we'll go ahead and save this to our photos so make sure you give it access to your photos and then you can see if we go back, whoops, let's go back one more time. You can see this entire screenshot of that web page right there. So definitely a cool extension for iOS 8. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.